Good evening everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Hope that you're doing absolutely fantastic. It is time for One About It Wednesday. Here we are. I have my lovely glass. I am ready to chat. Tonight I want to talk to you about Dooney and Burke and color. Here is something that I have learned. And I and, and if you have ordered from online or if you've ever tried to take a picture to show anyone, you probably have experienced this. This is a wonderful bag that I ordered from Denny Brooks. I want to show it to you. Look how beautiful that is. Do you see that color? I fell in love with that color. Now this bag is called the Wyndham Small Cade Drawstring. Okay. It was on sale. It was a wonderful price. I f just the, the whole, everything about this bag I loved. It was a lovely nylon. I felt that it would be soft. I saw the inside, like look at that, the inside pictures. Man, you can't pass that up. So I ordered it very quickly and I, I this was one of the bags I excitedly waited for. I ordered a charm on the spot for this bag. And when I got it, this is what I got. Now, don't get me wrong. The bag is still awesome and hasn't gone back anywhere. <laughs> um, but here's, here's what I got. Can you see that? This is not... Let me see if I can get them both up together. Can you see that? I mean, like... Could it be... Like, these are two completely different colors. And yet, if you look at what the what the color says, that this says this is charcoal, and when it came, certainly this is a charcoal. And I would honestly say that this color right here is probably closer to what I would consider charcoal than than this, because I thought this was more kind of like like a bluish greenish kind of color. Like when you see that, right? Like. That doesn't look charcoal-y, and it should have given me pause because I've experienced this before. Others have experienced it before. You know, it was an honest kind of mistake that I made. Oh, by the way, here's the really cool charm that I got. Thank you. I like it. You know, when I got it, I was really disappointed. I actually left it for a month in its wrapper. I was like, huh. I love the bag. I love a drawstring. They make me so happy. But I, I wasn't like a really big fan of the color. So I was like, I don't know what to do. So I waited. And then finally one day, I had the right outfit on. And I went, well, this might look okay with a gray. Let me go in and take, and take a look. I pulled it out. I put my stuff in it, I put it on my shoulder, and the rest is history. I mean, I will not send it back. I mean, I, I have found need for a charcoal bag. So here it is. The problem is, it's not really what I ordered. Do you guys find that that's an issue from time to time, that it's really hard to tell colors on Dooney and Burke? I will tell you, I was recently at the outlet, and I was trying to take pictures of some items to send to a friend to take a look at them. It was very difficult. What I was seeing with my eyes when I would hold the purse was very different from the picture that I would take and send. And I was trying to go like, look, it's darker than this. It's lighter than this. It's more gray than this. It's more green than this. It was very difficult. So I have to tell you, I don't know necessarily that it's the photographer's fault, but I'm like, what are they putting in these colors? Why is it so hard to get a true to color picture? Because I have to tell you, when I got that um, that Chanel lookalike, the, the, the Gabrielle Roca, like the, the color that came in was the color that was on the website. To, to me, it's a it's a phenomenon that's you know that's that's exclusive to Dooney and Burke. So I just want to know, what do you guys think about that? Is it um, do you do you experience that? Have you gotten a bag that you were like, oh? That is a beautiful color. And then when it comes in, you're like, mm, that's a hot mess. Or that's not as cool as I thought it was. And I have to tell you, with their restock policy, I'm like, you know, I, I'm not so excited about sending it back because, well, I don't want that restocking fee to hit me. So anyway, let me know what you think below. Comment on. If you liked it, this particular video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, that's okay. Give it a thumbs down. Um...
If you haven't taken a moment, take, if you haven't taken a moment already, please subscribe. That button is like here or here or, or here. That button is going to be somewhere near where you are looking at me. I'll go ahead and click it. It's red. It says subscribe. Click it, click it, click it. <laughs> take care, everyone, and have a great evening. And I will talk to you again very soon.